Arguably, no one outside of this year's Grizz football team knows more about what this group has gone through or has enjoyed seeing them reap their rewards, like former teammates who suited up alongside these guys the past few years. They know the day in and day out grind it takes to be successful at Montana and watching their former teammates succeed and make their run to the FCS national title game has been special for the now Grizz alums. I'm so pumped for all those guys that all the hard work they put in. I mean, the last four or three years, however long they've been there, you know, to get to this point. And it's just from an ex player, it's super cool to see all those guys succeed like they have and and put themselves in a situation to get to Frisco. Be at the beginning of the year, you always talk about winning the Big Sky like they did and then and then making it to the chip. So I think it's awesome. Grizz Athletics has deep-rooted pride and tradition, with all sports forming a tight-knit bond for those who go through the programs. Of course, that goes for football, as Montana returns to the national championship for the first time since 2009. Just the dominance, like just the culture of Grizz football, a powerful defense that doesn't give up anything and and an offense that that provides explosive plays and and is fun to watch is it's it's bringing it back to to old grizzly football dare i say but these guys are creating the, the atmosphere for it and grizz nation creates the atmosphere for it and, and it's it's just such it's just so much fun to watch former players whether it be last year to 20 years ago helped fortify the foundation of the program and while that's true this group competing in frisco is deserving of all of their flowers according to their former teammates with the way they've bounced back from the early loss to northern arizona and have since been on a roll to win 10 straight games. And that includes celebrating jubilantly when Montana beat North Dakota State to punch their ticket to the title game. That was so cool. I mean, the probably security guards don't like me, but I think I was one of the first people to jump jump, <laughs> jump on the field. I was like, there's no stopping me. I'm going to go congratulate these guys because I was just so happy for them. And to see that pure emotion on everyone's face down on the field, and they finally did it, you know got to a national championship. They've just completed all their goals and to be there with them. And I was just so happy for them. These guys saw all of the behind the scenes work this group put in when they were both up and coming younger players, but also as they started to see playing time. It's your best friend. You want your peers, your brothers to succeed. I understand everything that they've gone through and what they, what they did to get to that situation. And I was just as excited as them. It's awesome because they deserve it. They work their tails off to be in that situation and they got the themselves there and then executed and were able to succeed so it's amazing now watching as alums in post-college life seeing the Grizz get back to where they all wanted the program to be has brought joy to the alums and more well I think it means like everything to this community I mean not just as a former player but like you can tell like every game day I mean the whole city of Missoula is like behind the Montana Grizzlies no matter what that like they have the teams back and I think that as a former player if it's important to also you know be there in support and it, it means everything you know you want our buddies to succeed as well and you can bet come kickoff on Saturday afternoon they'll be tuned in as the loudest supporters for the guys in maroon and silver it is all pride you have no idea like it warms my heart so much. Every time a good play happens, no matter who it is on the field, like whether I know them or I don't, it's like, this is freaking amazing. Like these guys are awesome. Like it just warms my heart so much with joy to see the success and I'm just so happy for them. Reporting in Missoula, Kyle Hansen, MTN Sports.